Last year, when she launched an exhibition in Mumbai titled Harmony with the aim of displaying the best of Indian art under one umbrella, many thought it was a good idea. But they also wondered whether it could be sustained. But this week, former actress and now an important member of the Reliance corporate empire, Tina Ambani did one better in the role of an impresario. This year's Harmony boasted of a collection of works done by 102 eminent and lesser known artists and sculptors across the country who worked on a single theme. 50 years of India in its myriad spheres, cultural, artistic, spiritual and mystical. And the result was an upsurge of ideas and feelings as much as a harmony of colours, hues and figures. We've commissioned, these paintings have been commissioned, these are not something that I have selected, these are commissioned. The artists were given a brief, which uh, you may see in the invitation, which is, the, the brief is 50 years of Indian evolution. This is, we're celebrating our 50 years of uh, independence, so the brief is that. And uh, it says that the, the, the mystery, the, the, the mystic, the, the way India has grown spiritually, culturally, artistically, that's the subject. Organized by the Textile Division of Reliance Industries Limited, the India in Harmony exhibition is on at the city's Nehru Centre. The realm of high fashion designing is a lonely stream, but sometimes there are exceptions to the rule, as in the case of Delhi-based designers Vijay Arora and Rana, who chose to join hands than go it alone. The two launched their combined designer collection, Anant and Rana, at a fashion show in Delhi this week. 